What's up everyone and welcome back to the Overnight Channel and our weekly reaction video series that we've been doing. This one is all about the Blair House. Without any further ado, I'm not doing this reaction video alone. I'm gonna give a big warm welcome to Corbin Reinhardt. Come on in, Corbin. Corbin, where are you? Woo! All right, Woo! Corbin. Oh, thank you. Of course, uh, and of course, without you know the ghost magnet himself, yes. Corey Shearer. Yes. Please enter the building, Corey. Let's go, Corey. Corey. Corey? Come on, Corey. 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 <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you had us in there for a while. Yeah, I've been in there for a minute, huh? Yeah. Brandon? Who? Is Brandon not in there? Who? Brandon. Who? No. Oh, the man, the dude with the man bun. Yeah, yeah. The, this guy. Oh, yeah. I don't uh, know. All right, well, Brandon? come on in, Brandon. Oh! oh. Hey! hey. 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 We're yeah. doing this? Yeah. How long oh, are you in okay. there? Okay. I was, I was just, don't, don't worry about it. Are you sleeping? Don't look in there. I okay, yeah, let's, let's go. Bus. Let's do this. That doesn't look like a bus. That doesn't look like a bus to me. I thought you lived in your bus. Don't worry really about my living conditions, guys. Hey, go back in there. Go back in there. What? Go back in there. You no, know, you're gonna lock me in there. <laughs> 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 we all knew. I don't know. We I don't know why I listen to you when you make that little <laughs> voice. I don't oh my god, yeah. go back no. in there. Go back in there. Go back in there. And by the way, if you haven't noticed, this is our new set that we're filming on. We are at The Basement, the basement. a live escape experience. This one is the one in uh, Silmar, like Hollywood, yes. North Hollywood area. There's also one in Vegas, so check them out. This is one of the, the many rooms that they have. I've been a patron of this place for many years, and I, and I love it. I'm stoked that we're filming here. Yeah, so it's really, it's really cool. And I feel like maybe next time we do this, I should like, because they have live actors here that participate in the rooms. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I should just like ask a couple of them just to like randomly scare the shit out of all of us. Yeah. yeah. Next time. So if you guys like that idea, hit, hit the like button. And a bunch of people like that idea. <laughs> I'm going to hire just a bunch of their actors. Yeah, it's a good idea. Just come in and yeah. torment us. And well, then we'll, get, we'll get their input on the reaction. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. They scare us. <laughs> and by the way, if you don't know, we are still doing the overnight monthly contest where every. What? Every month we pick one person and we fly out to your hometown to bring you to do an overnight investigation or something fun, whatever it is that you want to do. There's two ways to enter. One super simple, just leave a like and a comment on this video. And every time you do that on each video, you do that on equals one entry. The other way is to head over to sendsociety.com, the clothing line that we run. Every dollar you spend also equals one entry and every month it restarts. So by the end of the year, we'll have you know 12 different winners, 12 different investigations. You're actually getting ready right now to go out and film with our last three winners um, so wow. that'll be happening pretty soon one of us one of them might be joining us at the conjuring house oh so really? what they happen to live very close to it wow so that's convenient the gang's all here and east side <laughs> <laughs> well fitting because with this video was an east side uh location it was mm. interesting and i think this reaction video is going to have a little bit of a different feel to it I don't think we're gonna be playing as many clips and more so like talking about what happened because everything, uh, I left this video basically uncut. The, the, it was crazy. This one was one of my favorite ones to do. This yeah. is like, this is probably the experience that really turned everything around yeah. for me. Yeah. For, really? uh, yeah, I did. Like this is actually kind of made me feel weird. So if you haven't for some reason seen that video and you're on this one, go watch that video. Everything's there, and then come back to this because we're going to talk about oh, everything boy. that happened. I will say there were a few things that I was able to like, kind of re-go through that I think are worth revisiting that yeah. we're going to talk about, as well as like meeting Kristen for the first time yeah. and doing like our first like I guess table seance because we had done one before yeah, at right. Penhurst, mm -hmm. yeah. but we we're all on the ground. But this was like what felt to me like a proper. Seance. So when you think of a yeah. seance, it's what you think of when you're all sitting at the table and your Crystal hands are ball. up. and 100%, yeah. Gypsy. <clears throat> all, all I think about when I think of this place is the roar. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, that's, the, well, that's all I, I think about. I feel like about. that did not get enough attention. I no. looked that at was that crazy. and I was just thinking to myself, I didn't, I didn't hear it. No. I didn't hear it. No. Mm -hmm. Well, you're going to hear it because I have it laid out. And Perfect. I have it uh, compared to a different sound that we heard. What? And they sound almost identical. Ooh, I think I know what he's uh, talking about. We were in the area. We were doing a high reformatory. Yep. We were doing Trans Allegheny. We were mm. doing West Virginia Penn. Yeah. We had a lot of like big known locations. And yeah. then Blair House was there, mm -hmm. which seemed kind of weird because it was all about like there was like ley lines, yep. and then there was like Indian burial grounds, and then there was like miners, and then there was like a heart attack there. And there a was, lot of like, stuff happened. Sand. It was like all. It was like this giant hosh posh. Pope Paris 
mixture of just yeah. random things that were there, and it just seemed like they were really taking a stretch at like why it should be. Yeah, that potpourri. Dude, I mean, how many miners died like under that house? Like eighteen or something, practically. I don't even. They had to be under eighteen to be miners. Oh, correct. That's true. Mm. Yeah. It was a very like mundane house, and it wasn't like axe murder house. Kind of small too. Some exactly. Yeah. Where like there small. was like something that happened. It wasn't like conjuring house where like. The Warrens had been. Yeah, it was like a house where someone did a séance a super long time ago. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I was very skeptical yeah. going into it. How many houses do you think that there are like that in the world? Oh, it's where it's, just, it's in a normal neighborhood. Yeah. Like all the houses look the exact same. Can't really point one out and be like, oh, that's a haunted house right there. <laughs> but then once you actually learn about it, it's like, oh yeah, they used to summon this here, and all these people died here. And I think so. I feel like I would know about them. Exactly. I only know of four. I know of Whaley, yeah. uh, Villisca, Bel Air, mm-hmm. and Conjuring. Yeah. yeah, but think about how many houses like there could be Indian burial grounds on. Like, but one, of my, oh, for sure. one of the people that I know, he like, lived on one that actually did have an Indian burial ground yeah. beforehand. And it's just like, that just happens. But think think yeah. about yeah. like the amount of people that were like in cults and they would do seances and stuff like that. And mm-hmm. now it's just like a normal family with three kids living there. Yeah. And they're like, why do I keep seeing a demon yeah. on my baby monitor? <laughs> yeah. You know? I mean, I told you guys that I lived in a house that used to be a crematorium. It was inside the cemetery. Yeah. You don't remember that? No. But yeah. like, and there was like the little kid footprints on the trampoline. What? Because there was snow. Yeah. You don't know about this? No, I don't know about this. But yeah. it doesn't surprise me. I feel like you would choose to, like, someone well, would tell you this used what? to be a cream I was a, I was a, I'll I, take it. It was not my choice. It was my mother's choice. Uh, <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. The only house we could afford in that experience. Why? So your mother was a ghost hunter. <laughs> yes, exactly. Uh, <laughs> she instilled it in me. Runs in the family. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yeah, yeah. She yeah. made Makes you Makes sense one. now. Mm-hmm. With all that being said, we went into this place, in my opinion, a little like, meh. Yeah. We'll see. And also, there was a backstory to it where there was a BuzzFeed video made about this place. The guys who investigated it kind of made fun of yeah. the owner yeah. of the house. They had that weird, and she had that relationship with YouTubers, and it was yeah. kind of a weird, like, yeah. all right, let's see how this goes. Which is kind of rude, yeah. you know, at the end of the I day. Know, like, she's allowing them permission they, to come like, film there. Exactly. And, like, you're going to allow someone to investigate your house, and you're going to yeah, laugh at them. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to laugh at what they experience. It's, it's one thing to be, like, skeptical, sure, mm-hmm. to be like, that sounds... A little yeah no but he straight up laughed at it. yeah yeah, yeah. So regardless crazy. as soon as we walked into the house it ended up being one of the creepiest houses like we've seen possibly like, not like, like old me. dilapidated like run down but like I mean, look, at, look at this place as soon as we walk in because at this point you walk in there's skulls and there's black mirrors yeah. and there's all these different items yeah. And like you immediately were like, this feels like the place where yeah. people would do crazy shit. And yeah. I'm like, yeah, that's, that's why we're here. That's exactly right. That's exactly <laughs> why we're here. Exactly. That is 100% accurate. Perfect. Woo. And I will say, this is one of the few times that not only did I know the history of a place, but also Brandon did. That's right. And normally you guys hate it when I withhold information, but Brandon got to have some fun with me on this one. You know, it's nice to be on his side sometimes. Mm. So it was, it was pretty fun being able to like hold back information. This is like a currently active place where people are still doing like demonic like rituals and spells and stuff. Do you want me to say yes or yes or yes? I'm going to be here in an hour yeah. to explain everything. I, I remember that part. You gave me just, three options. But just thinking about it, like yeah. you were just saying, like we had no idea like anything about that place. And with it being like a... As weird as it was. A, a what? Like, do cult leaders just go there? Like, they're like, well, where should we go tonight? No, not Airbnb. Let's go to Bel Air House. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, is it just a normal thing? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. It was a lot of fun. It was. It was. It, was it actually fun. was. Okay, it actually was. It actually was. was. But, but, like, think about how, like, demonic that house is. Like, was it? I mean, the, the uh, roar? Yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun, and then also at the same time, you can't sleep. I didn't sleep. I, I tried you so You can't hard. sleep. Kristen herself like was like, no, I'm oh, yeah. shutting this down. She, oh, and she yeah. also sh- she does the uh, cleansing of the house every mm-hmm. once in a while as well. She sages it. Yeah, yeah but just from back in the day, imagine what no, people I were summoned what in saying. there. There yeah. were skulls. There was black mirrors. It's like still, there was still probably with you today. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, great. Yeah. yeah. After we kind of like decided, like, okay, Kristen was going to be here like an hour, so we wanted to go explore the house ourselves. Yes. yes. And at the time, none of us really realized where we were, what was happening. And when you guys like said like the door slammed, I literally like just thought you guys were joking. But when you also pay attention to what room you guys are in, right? Pay attention to the mirror that's in the room and where we are. When the door slams, keep that in mind for where we end up spending the rest of the night later. Mm. What is 
black mirrors are like. Oh. Imagine Brandon being down the stairs. Who's that? Dude, I remember this moment That's so clearly. Uh, I literally just ignored you guys because there's someone slamming the door. I'm like, all right, yeah. I think we should just leave it this room. No, no, wait, 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 but let's clear it up real quick. I mean, at that time, I thought you guys were pulling a prank on us. No, I was. So just, none of y'all closed the door. Brand, no. Brandon was like two rooms around, and I was in a different room. Yeah. So that legit just closed by itself. Do you remember yeah. that, bro? Like, I kind of had like a deja vu moment. Like, I felt like I was living it again. We were in such confusion. Mm -hmm. To like what? <laughs> what the yeah. hell was that? And then also just starts talking, I'm like, okay. Do you that realize what door that is? That's is that the, the, that's the door yeah, of the REM ends up being set up. Crazy room. Because that's the, that's the so black that's where we're sitting. The, where we're, yeah. the camera was here, and then that's the door. And then we, you end up, Corey ends up sitting there. I did yeah. not know that was the plan. Mm -hmm. Wow. So it's the same it, was trying to, it was trying to tell us to just stay in there. It was, yeah, it was the same exact door. Yeah. That I just I found that interesting oh. when I played that back. It's like I literally just thought you guys were like just trying to I thought you guys were trying to freak us out. No. No, you see yeah. the footage. We we're uh. not even close to the door. See, that's why I'm so happy we film all of this stuff. We oh. can go back and watch. You know how many times we'll be somewhere investigating using that and we don't hear really anything clearly, but then for some reason as soon as we hear it yeah. on the computer, the words are clear mm -hmm. as day. Oh, I know, yeah. It doesn't make sense to me. It's yeah. crazy. This was also the first place we ever went to that had like journals. Oh, like, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Handwritten yes. Mm -hmm. evidence, like, I don't know, reaccounts of like. I wish that was more common in places. Yeah. Like, the only other place was uh, X Murder House. They it had, had a huge yeah. basket of papers, but it yeah. wasn't like per room. No. But, yeah, it was a really cool thing to have like all of these different like diary pages here to go through. Yeah. Um, so I was, I was pumped to see it and like, you know, here's us like finding it for the first time. I found this when I came in. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Corey, you want to read that? Ooh. About the room we're sleeping in? Is this the, is this the room? <sighs> Pittsburgh Paranormal Society. First night in this room. Had a lot of orb activity. Hmm. It's just, it's really cool that they write who they are, what they had, the times they had it. And it's, and it's really neat, especially, I feel like, Dang. if you read it in the morning after. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. if you read it after to up. see what line up. Things think, did line up, didn't mm -hmm. they? Exactly. Oh, yeah. yeah. But then we finally get to meeting Kristen for the first time. Yeah. And the story that she wouldn't tell us, mm -hmm. which we kind of know why, is because I feel like she felt like maybe we would make fun of her again. Yeah. yeah. But regardless, was like an incredibly like interesting person to me. And definitely. Oh, yeah, great. <laughs> the first joke she makes is like, I'm going to lock us in, huh? Yeah. <laughs> like, that's just how she welcomes it's us. It's weird meeting her in her own house when yeah. we're already in it. Like, mm -hmm. like we're, we're like, her in our own welcome, house. Welcome yeah. Yeah. Her. Yes. Yeah. I will say one of the most beneficial things that happened, and again, I had never met her before. None of us had ever met her before. Mm -hmm. She owns this house. This is, like, what she does also, like, for a living in terms of being like a medium and doing seances. And she said something that I've been trying to say to all of us at that point in time for the longest time. What'd she say? Which is when shit starts happening, just stay there ah. and let the shit keep happening instead of like sprinting away. You kidding me? When it, we're at Biltmore and that, that telephone rings, I'm not just gonna be able to be like, oh, let me just uh, pick <laughs> that up. But I you jumped. Did. Well, that was like I four, did. four yeah. times later. But I you know? jumped. Like it just it just gets you sometimes. Yeah. yeah. No, that's not that's not what I'm saying. It's like we used to have this habit that was super frustrating. It's like every time something could happen, everyone would be like, okay, we gotta leave. We're done. Yeah. It's yeah. too scary. We gotta no, leave. And like, right, well, then right, why yeah. are why are we here? Yeah. Like, yep. why are we here to just leave when someone gets scared? It's like that's the whole point. That yeah. makes sense. And then when this complete stranger comes in and tells us that, and this happens to be the very first night where we don't like turn off any equipment, where we don't leave, that we actually mm -hmm. just sit there and just let it run its course. Mm -hmm. yep. It ends up being one of the craziest nights we've ever had. Don't jump, don't run, talk. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Look <laughs> oh. <laughs> at your face. This is his common thing for us, that we need to actually be happy about it. I don't think there's a physical bone in my body that can't be happy about it. I'm so scared of anything like this. Sam. Sam. 
Or I'm in a way. But in that moment, for the love of everything that is in the afterlife, stay in that moment and investigate what yeah. the heck is going on. Look at this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your hands. Look at your hands uh, shaking. I'm like, come on. This is what I've been saying for so long. <laughs> it is good advice. It really it, it is. is. Yeah. It is. And it, it like 100%. We've adapted that ever since. And yeah. it's and been. And look what we've been getting since. It's been yeah. wonderful. Yeah. And it's like, it's so great that like we ended up meeting her and it led to all this. And mm -hmm. this also ended up being, like I said, what it felt like our first like real seance. Yeah. yeah. And I actually thought it was like a really cool experience because to me, this yeah. was always something you saw like in movies. Mm -hmm. And to actually like sit at a table and do one, it made it was like, oh, this is like real. Like this, this is the first is, time any of us have done that. Yeah. Like that, right? It's like yeah. something you'd like yeah. see like, uh, you know, I mean, that setup. Yeah. 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 It's yeah. like yeah, something I was you'd nervous. Like see like sketch from like the 1700s. Oh, definitely. But we're like actually genuinely doing one, you know, hundreds of years later. Yeah. 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 We gotta leave lunch here open for Emma. We have to. That was very important. And we're always have lunch here. Skull. Look at that skull. Candle. And the, and the black candle. Like our feet are level with the ground. All these like little tiny rules that she like had, all these like little things, like make sure you're fully grounded. Yeah. And the Can't candle. cross your legs. Exactly. Mm -hmm. All, yeah, all these different, <laughs> all these different little things that she had Jesus. that really made like a huge difference in what yeah. she was trying to have happen. Yeah. Also, we have absolutely no idea what she said during this part of the seance. So like, we actually, I still don't know what she said. Was it a different language? What do you mean? Yeah, I don't know. So like, we just like trusted this lady and like have absolutely no idea if she like cast a spell on us or like Stop. open. What? I don't know. I never thought about it because it just happened. Let me hear, let me hear you. Yeah, my yeah. Or Lord, oh, yeah, my yeah. I say so, yeah, my yeah. I don't know she what she's been she, saying. Like, please screw wait, these people we, over very heavily. Is there any? Uh, uh, is there any like comments on what she said? Like, like in our in our comments? Not or? that I saw. All right, guys. Really? Please comment down below yeah. if you have a clue what she's saying. What does it sound like? That sounds like not Spanish, but it sounds something. Around I don't that. know. What that yeah, is, I don't know bro. what it is. What I do know is this is the first time we'd ever had a sound like shut down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or anyone just be like, eh, we're done here." Oh yeah. yeah she because said of, that. of the three growls and how it was mocking the uh, the Trinity. Tell us what town we're in. Yeah. That thing was creepy. Jeez. And she just stood up and yeah. shut it down. Yeah, immediately. just immediately. Yeah. I want you guys to remember what that girl sounds like. I convinced her uh, very politely to leave us her device mm -hmm. that she had just shut down. Because I wanted to still use it. She didn't want to use it anymore. But I was like, well, can we borrow it? We'll just leave it here. She finally like agrees to do it. We take it like upstairs to the attic. Oh. Completely different part of the house. First thing it says, and one of the first times I ever recall a spirit box or anything like that ever saying, and it says my name. Like, on I the dot, that. like, says, it says, says Elton. very clearly. Elton? <laughs> I remember that. Elton? I remember that. Do you remember how clear that was? Very clearly. Jesus Christ. And then again, it's going to say my name one more time. And then it's gonna say something else that none of us caught that night, and I guess I didn't even, I don't know if I caught it in editing, but we didn't catch it. And then it says, watching you. Oh. Oh. Was it, it was like, it was like whispering. Yeah, it was yeah. like, watching you. It's like right here. Wait, it goes, you hear that? Watching mm -hmm. you. Oh my wow. God. It says my name, and it says my name again. That is so creepy. How does it keep saying Elton? That's not a common name. No, that is not a common name. And then we go to a different device. We go to the Obulus, yes. and we get a series of words. We've used the Obulus quite a few times. We've like seen some words pop up twice, but we've never gotten this series of words before. And then also, fun fact, we're all American. We're American. Eric, you already showed new words, but it got worse. Did it say it down? It says knife American later. Knife what? American later? A series of words. After it said my name, I'm an American, and it said watching you. Or something like that in the beginning. What it say? Can you pick that? You can see that? Yep. Right? That is actually really weird. So at this point, Brandon and I are withholding that. We're not oh, telling yes. you guys what it says. So you yes. guys have no idea 
what it says on the obvious at that point in time. Like, and we're just listening. You have no idea. Yeah, we're, we're not just, saying anything. Do you anything. know my name? I'm gonna knife an American later, and then later it says American, good luck here, on two different devices, back and forth. Literally, he is going back and forth. <laughs> two completely unrelated devices that have absolutely yeah. no connection to each other, no connectivity to each other. <laughs> American. Mm hmm. What? How Isn't many minutes was that apart, would you say? No, that was like in a sequence. That was probably within like two minutes. Yeah, he that was yeah, all in like one. That. Yeah. yeah, it was just kind of one big flowing piece. And then, so the one thing I want to point out is in this room, the REM pod's set up. Yeah. The REM pod never goes off. Never once goes off. It's not a malfunction. It never no, does. Where do we have it at? Yeah. And uh, you, you're going to see it in this. It's going to be right at the top of the stairs. Okay. Yeah, yeah we yeah. always so keep it right sitting the stairs. right there. And then, if you start putting the, together the pieces of what the obvious is saying and the room we end up going into and the same room that had the door slam, it's pretty interesting how it all kind of ends up working out. Is it later, pillow, square, knife, American? Yes. And the room with the black mirror has a square bed in it. Mm -hmm. So we're not sleeping in a square bed sure. tonight. Yeah. <laughs> and that's your REM pod. Mm -hmm. It's been there the whole time. It's right there at the top of the stairs. It's never gone off. That's weird. It never went off to we went down to that one particular that room. Is, that and it does weird. have like a square bed. Like most beds are rectangular. Mm -hmm. And it genuinely has like a weird, perfectly square bed. I don't know why. Yeah, but so, I mean we're not sleeping that one. Yeah. No. Well I I, I, I mean, mean you can. Yeah. Kristen stopped the stands because she heard three growls. We used that portal device uh -huh. for like an hour. Never once heard mm -hmm. a growl with it. But then we hear the like a real one. Mm. Does a real growl sound like the one from the op? That's what he's saying. I, I picked it up and got threat immediately. What? Yes. Immediately That's so, so similar. Immediately, I, I picked it up and got threat immediately. What? Immediately got threat. Probably was someone's stomach. What's that you? No. Are you talking about that? I heard that. I literally. Are you talking about? No, I heard that. When Corbin said what? It yeah, was that you? No, I do that. that? No, you were telling me that was you heard that, right? No, it was like, Ooh, yeah, what? You heard that, right? that is Corbin, so that you, right? crazy. I'm just gonna recap. That device, the same device that made the noise earlier, is yeah, we weren't off. even using. I want to hear. I want to hear the. Uh, I want to hear that the, the right. growl again. What? Because that hear? sounds so no similar. That sounded just like the same growl, but then there wasn't no echo because exactly. the device yeah. has an echo behind it. Mm -hmm. Listen, I put them back to back. Oh, what? That's so similar. Oh my god! Literally, just with the echo is the only difference. Just without like the staticky of the of the, that came from of the, the my, portal. But that that the the growl with Corbin didn't come from any device. No, no, we just heard that out in the room with. They, they're saying mm -hmm. it, it came from my stomach. And I didn't well, no, it sounded it. like it came from like your like mouth. Yeah, yeah. something. That's what I thought right off yeah. the bat. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you guys. Does that mean he got like possessed for like half a second or something? That's just or weird. Or it didn't come from him, and it just just from the room. It, it, the room. It, uh, we were sitting I next to Corbin. That. It came from Corbin. Dude, I remember, dude. We were sitting next to him, and we like watched him roar. <laughs> Like, it came from Corbin, and we all were what just like... What if he like, did get, like, a little possessed? Dude, I just don't remember hearing the sound. I know, I know. But I remember playing it back for you. Yeah. And you freaking out. Yeah. Dude, I it's the same that. as, like, when Patty at Cecil, she didn't know after the fact, like, any of the stuff that had happened. Mm, yeah. It could be, like, the same thing. Like, he didn't know. And anything. then remember whenever we were at the Biltmore, I was talking to myself when the phone was ringing. I didn't remember that. Yeah. Are we all, like, low-key getting more and more possessed? No, like, you two are, but we're good. I'm chilling. That is good. Going oh, on. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one more time. I, I'm, I'm low key in shock. That right is now. nuts. Ah! I mean, that's, that's so that's weird. Pretty Very damn similar. similar. It's like, boop. Yeah. Wow. So, yeah, after, after this, we shut down the whole like attic area. I wanted to see the rest of the house. Went yeah. down to the basement, checked that out, some more journals, checked out all the other rooms. Then we ended up just like going back into like that same room with the giant black mirror. Yeah. And this was kind of the night where I feel like. The fact that Evan and I like were going back and forth for like two hours, trying to like figure out what the hell could have happened and caused it. This was like one of those nights where we were like, holy shit. I mean, it was one of the few times I've ever left a video completely uncut. Yeah. I just left a one hour straight clip. You're with the rent pod? Same rent pod. All right, so we have everyone 
sitting in. This is the bedroom. I had the most full notebook. Yeah. The REM pod is in the corner. It's actually closest to the doorway where something can come in and get to Corey before it gets to us. Stop. <laughs> I'm really glad it's going to Corey first. Um, well, stop. Thanks, We're man. all in this together. Well, well, you might be over there and we might still be over here together. Yeah. <laughs> We're all in this together, but you're first. I'm just hoping you're all. Oh, we're mean. Anymore. We're so mean to Corey. Yeah. When if Corey just started getting drunk by his left foot, I would all you guys do. Oh. Grab a <laughs> <laughs> I would like. I would immediately figure out how to get out of this window into a main. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh. First time it ever goes off. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I was like hugging you. Yeah. Someone bails, no one grabs a camera. Oh. <laughs> Corey! Oh my god. <laughs> I, I, I literally was hugging Elton, I remember we that. We were joking. Everybody mm. was just joking. Yeah. And then it happened. And oh man, I want to see like that clip one more time because I want to see how quiet everybody gets after we hear it. Because you can see all of us just like, our, our smiles just leave. <laughs> I would like, I would immediately figure out how to get out of this window into a main. Oh, God. Look at all of our smiles uh. just go. <gasps> Holy shit. What? what? Wait. What? Oh, that's fucking weird. That's just weird what? timing. Wait, wait, wait. Remember the door slam earlier? Yeah. 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 Oh, oh, the slam. Yeah. And then it goes off. Wait. I just find it super weird that you hear that similar noise. That's that literally how it all so started. Active. That's how it all started. I was just joking around, fucking wow. with Corey. But it loved jokes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And this, that. by the way, is one of the many jokes he told that night. Two female deer come walking out of a bar, and they go, wow, I can't believe we just blew a hundred bucks. That's one of my favorites. <laughs> that's, a good, that's a good joke. That a good you like that one. Okay. You'll like that one. That is a pretty good one. That's a good joke. 45 That's minutes of this video of you just jokes. going through R-rated dad jokes. Corbin taught me that I joke. Told oh, that joke. Nice. I told him that joke, everybody. <laughs> this one's interesting. This is one of the big comments. That the mirror moves on its own. And I don't get how. Evan and I have gone through this. The lighting source never changed. Nothing in the room ever changed. Somehow the mirror shifts. But not only does the mirror shift, it doesn't make a sound because no one hears it. That the only person that looks back is Corey. Uh, and the Corey, mirror on the on the pedestal. dresser okay. on the dresser yeah. moves, and only Corey like for some reason like feels something, sees something, hears something. No like one Corey else does. does, and it comes from my side. What? So I haven't seen this. Okay. What? See it? Right there. Watch. Watch the mirror move. Oh my oh, god! Oh, yeah! The whole mirror moves, and it doesn't make any sense why. That's weird. That's just, That's just weird. Alright, so, now from the same side that Corey looked at, this is the first time I had ever been, like, scratched or felt oh, anything. Yeah, I forgot about that. Oh. And I never knew that you looked over that way. I never knew that the mirror moved. I never knew any of that happened. So, and, it, and it's on the same exact side, because I believe it's my right hand, right, and I'm on your right side, so it would have been that's exactly right, right, where yeah. you were looking. Get the fuck out. Were you scratched? Show yeah. the flashlight. Right side. Show the flashlight. Wow. Flashlight. I don't have a scar on my hand. Look at that. It's hard. Look, look at the, from the side, you can see the ring. Oh, you have two scratches? Holy shit. Elton, you got scratched? They're like deep scratches where it I raised. Guess. It was like a like a cat like scratch. It like raised the skin up like it was swelling. I know I know where my scars are on my knuckles. No, boy, also, no, I'll point out this whole time I'm never looking this back is, to where uh, the door is. Uh huh. Yeah. I never yeah. looked at the door. No, it's not. Do you want to show the camera? And after all that, we try to leave the room and we can't. The obvious mm -hmm. hadn't gone off for a while. That's Sorry, right. the REM pod hadn't gone off for a while, and we all tried to leave the room, and we couldn't. Yep. So I'm curious, so after this clip, after we watch it, do you guys think it was for a good reason or a bad reason? I think it was for a good reason. Did something happen that we, no. I don't know. The only things before that were the growls. So I feel like, I don't know. I don't know, but it liked jokes though. So like, it was like, that's true, that's true. Are we allowed to leave this room? I'm gonna leave this room, all right? Leave this room. Yeah, I'm gonna leave this room. 
I made the can oil first. Yeah, I mean, basically just did a really, really long sound. And you're not closing it out properly. <laughs> you're not and even close. Leave the room. They He's get beat with the cans. You're not even close. Yeah, you're not even remotely close to that thing. I don't think he wants to leave the room. And my foot's not even on the ground, my right foot. So my weight never shifted. Jesus See? Christ. We thought maybe oh, it was... Leaving. I mean, if I get any closer, it'll be minus it. Oh. You can't leave either. No one's gonna be... We have to look, at the, look at the marks on those on the floor. Look, it's still going. That's the mark. I have. I didn't get past that, and you didn't get past that. Also, I mean, everybody who's seen the video already knows, it takes... You have to be way closer to it to be oh, able yeah. to set it off. Oh, yeah, you, you pretty yeah. much gotta be touching it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. To, 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 at, least, at least a foot. Yeah. yeah. And we did... I think it's in the video. I think we spent a good amount of time like being like, could you definitely stomp it? Could you oh, step yeah. on a certain floorboard? Sure. Like, could anything set it off? And like, we could not. Nothing. We couldn't figure it out. Especially up there on the uh, uh, attic. Yeah, and it never what went off the there. Any, any place that? would have had like a creaky floor. Yeah. To like move it up and down, that would have been at the attic, but it never happened. And that was the room where the door first slammed. That was the room that the door first slammed. And we never. You put and that I together. were in there. Never and knew. it happened to have the giant black mirror in it, the only room with the giant black mirror. Dude, what is the mirror that? moving? That are the, I don't know if the mirror could Cor move. Could you guys have hit it? Like, is it possible? No, the dresser was Dog. flush against the wall. It wouldn't have shifted. And like, it doesn't even look like the mirror moves. It looks like the image within the mirror moves. Yeah. yeah. So it it doesn't. You don't see the frame of the mirror. That gave me chills. Move. Oh, like, it just felt like well. everything within the mirror just like took a weird little angle to it. That part happened after we were done with the black mirror. And at that point, the black mirror would have been facing the mirror that too. Mirror. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely, I think, the craziest night that maybe we've had as TFIO. I agree. One of the most active nights. Yeah, for sure. Built, built more still. Oh, that, but that was oh, nuts. Oh, but that, yeah, that's That like, was nuts. But th what? this was the one that made us like learn a lot of really valuable lessons, like to sit still and just spend a lot of time in one place. Yeah. As opposed to like five minutes here, five minutes here, five mm -hmm. minutes here, five minutes here, and expecting to get something everywhere. Yeah. How long were we sitting there? Over an, an hour. hour. For a long like, time. Over an hour. Three, yeah, three, yeah, three and a half hours. Three and a half. Yeah, we were there for a we, long portion. Because we I, we wouldn't leave. Yeah, we started yeah. at we started in that room at like four thirty seven. Yeah. When we like actually got in there, and by the time we like set up the camera, it was like five. Mm -hmm. And then we were basically in there until our flight. Le we had to leave for yeah. our flight. Yeah, yeah like that's seven, right. seven something. Yeah. I think that was the first place where we all kind of like you were saying a second ago got more comfortable with activity happening mm -hmm. and being able to just sit there and be like okay this is going off right well, now. Well just look yeah. at the way that it happened I mean like when that first thing started going off you like grabbed Elton and then maybe what like 10 minutes later yeah. you're He's cracking jokes. jokes. Yeah, yeah exactly yeah. it was that's yeah, true. Oh, yeah, we're just getting better with it you know yeah. every single time we do something. And we went into that entire place with jokes I and mean, that was like the whole like pouty face like whenever you want to share information oh, yeah. Yeah, that's hold right. it in. Oh yeah. So that whole place like we were just joking around. I want to go investigate right now. I don't know if anybody that's else. I literally yeah. like. I'm low key wanting to go ghost hunt right it's now. Coming up the soon. Next one's Queen Mary. I think next one's Queen Mary. <laughs> Depends on the order. It's either going to be Queen Mary or uh, Alcatraz. Mm. We're going to get probably some insane evidence, dog. There's quite a few. Stanley Hotels on the horizon. Shang uh, <coughs> the Shanghai Tunnels in Portland. Both of those places we can't leave if we wanted to. Oh yeah, yeah. I I, I I wasn't with you guys. I've been on the Queen Mary by myself, and it was creepy as the hell. Queen Mary is haunted. It is like creepy like as hell. compared to a lot of the places we've been. Like we get some crazy like, stuff, but the Queen Mary is for sure haunted. All I'm yeah. comparing it to in my head is the USS Salem that we were at. That was that was I creepy, think the Queen Mary is more haunted. Well. Thank you all so much for, for watching this video and tuning in to the Overnight Channel. Thank Again, you. we are still working on new videos. You're literally hearing us talk about it, what we have lined up. And that's the reason why we're kind of posting like the master cuts of like old three-part series is to kind of keep this channel still going and flowing, get new people on while we're filming, editing, planning, all of the fun pieces that have to go into these videos are getting done. So when we do finally post a new video, we have new one after new one after new one after new one. <laughs> bang, bang, so, bang. We're making sure we're top loading as much as we can. We are going to Waverly Hills. We are going to Bobby Mackey's. We are going back to the Conjuring House. We are going actually into the Salem Witch House, um, which was oh. not easy to get to happen. But what? that one, I forgot about that one too. Salem actually. Witch House? The real one, yeah. The like actual, in Salem? 
Yeah, like the real one. It was they said no to us last time. Um, so that one's coming about, <laughs> and a bunch of other cool stuff. We might go to the Shanley. Um, Josh just went there. He got the like Shanley. Yeah, Shanley. Sh yeah, Shanley I Hotel. It's in uh, East East New York. And Josh just did a video there, and Josh was like, holy fuck, you gotta go. Wow. And I'm like, all right, if Josh is telling us to go, who's like a very yeah. skeptic, I was yeah. like, cool. Yeah. That's a death fact. Uh, so a lot of cool stuff coming up, and we appreciate you guys all being here. We're going to make these videos the best they can be. Yeah. Well, thanks, guys, and see you guys in the next video.